So this is Jalo, and he's now in, well, study mode. He's got his copy and his Truman Iron Curtain speech that he has marked up. And he just wanted to share some of his answers with you. So notice he is doing some things well and some things not so well. So what is missing on this immediately that you see, you guys? What is it that you see? Ah, yes, you named it. These should be one, two, three, four, and five, okay? The paragraph should be numbered. Did you get rid of your hairdo? Oh. Okay. Uh, most of you guys did pretty well on this, I have to say. And you should know that um, the Iron Curtain is a separation between a communist East and a democratic West. I'm um, Winston Churchill. He's the one that coined the phrase and it has been used ever since to differentiate between the Eastern Bloc countries that were under Stalin's control and under control of all future leaders of the Soviet Union, okay? All of these capitals that a lot of you circled that was a good thing to circle because it basically states the power in the Eastern Bloc, okay? And all of those capitals were in the Eastern Bloc and they're all gonna be controlled by Stalin. Moscow is symbolic of Stalin. Communist Center is symbolic of Stalin, okay? And this is all about the Eastern Bloc. This is what Churchill is talking about. Okay, then it says, I do not believe that the Soviet Russia desires war. What they desire is the fruits of war and the indefinite expansion of their power and doctrines. Okay, so fruits of war, you guys, natural resources and a market. Please remember those from, you need those two things in order to continue industrialization. And the doctrine they're talking about is communism. This is the belief system. And then with any primary source, please remember, you always have to figure out who's stating it, but you guys were already solid on that, that uh, Churchill's the prime minister of Great Britain. Okay, so there you have it. And where's my student? <whistles> Jalo, what are you doing? Oh, he's not the best student right now. What are you doing, buddy?